sisters, this is Queen's Freedom Mike. Um, it's December 28th. I got a word uh, yesterday from the Holy Spirit on December um, December 27th. And I'm going to first do a reading out of the King James Version of the Bible. Please go ahead and pause this and uh, go ahead and get your Bible open and read along with me. Uh, Jonah chapter 2. It's a short chapter. I'm going to read the whole thing. And then I'm going to give you the word I got. That's related to it. Then Jonah prayed unto the Lord his God out of the fish's belly and said, I cried by reason of mine affliction unto the Lord, and he heard me out of the belly of hell, cried I, and thou heardest my voice. For thou hast cast me into the deep in the midst of the seas, and the floods compassed me about. All thy billows and all thy waves passed over me. Then I said, I am cast out of thy sight. Yet I will look again toward thy holy temple. The waters compassed me about, even to the soul of the depth closed me round about. The weeds were wrapped about my head. I went down to the bottoms of the mountains. The earth with her bars was about me forever. Yet hast thou brought up my life from corruption, O Lord my God. When my soul fainted within me, I remembered the Lord. And my prayer came in unto thee into thine holy temple. They that observe lying vanities forsake their own mercy. But I will sacrifice unto thee with the voice of thanksgiving. I will pay that that I have vowed. Salvation is of the Lord. And the Lord spake unto the fish, and it vomited out Jonah upon the dry land. Um, okay, so this word was actually for me personally, but it might help somebody who's going through the same thing. And um, that's because we have daily struggles with our own thoughts and uh, fighting to be perfected in the Lord's eyes until we get changed and we're, we're sin free, but we're not sin free till we're, we're uh, translated. Okay, um, and this is called chart a straight course. And once again, this was for me, but somebody else here uh, might appreciate this if they're going through it. Sin not for fear of the Lord, your Father and Son, is righteousness and my will. How long, O Son of Man, will you not hear my voice challenging you to take the reins and steer your ship away from the rocks in the tumultuous seas you transverse seeking refuge within me? The goal, the prize. Again, look back not and make your course true in righteousness, found only in my living word. Therein lies the chartered path for the helm master of your temple wherein you dwell with the Holy Spirit as your compass, your companion, and your source of true light and bearing. Take refuge in my light, in my word, and in my presence. Heal your sorrows and wounds inflicted upon yourself by your willful transgressions. Repent and sin no more. Listen to your comforter and be convicted in his truth written now upon your soul. Come home now, chart the straight and narrow path, and make way for the coming of the Lord. I hope this blesses somebody, and God bless you all, in the name of our Father in heaven, Yahweh, Yahushua, HaMashiach, the Messiah, Amen.